hello everyone welcome back to my channel today in this tutorial i'm going to show how to crochet this beautiful and easy brooch so keep watching for the pattern i will be using embroidery thread three strands 0.5 mm crochet hook brooch pin scissor and glue so these are the things required first we are going to start with a slip knot chain multiples of two I did a total of 36 chain I've completed all 36 chain now we are going to chain three We are going to start making double crochet from the fourth chain and make one double crochet in each chain all across. I'll just go ahead and complete all my double crochet. I'll see you guys in the end. As you can see, I have completed all my double crochet. Now we're going to make petals, so chain five. Skip the first chain, make a slip stitch in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the last chain. We're going to skip one stitch and make a slip stitch in the next stitch. So this is our first petal. We're going to repeat one more time, chain 5. Skip the first chain, make a slip stitch in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the last chain. Skip one stitch, make a slip stitch in the next stitch. So repeat this and complete all the petals. I'll see you guys in the end. As you can see, I have completed all my petals. This is the last one. We are going to make a slip stitch in the third chain. In the end, we have a total of 18 petals. We are going to fasten up the thread and weave the ends. We are going to roll it in the form of a flower. With the help of a needle, we are going to stitch the bottom of the flower. You can even use glue if you want.
tie both the ends together to secure now adjust the patterns accordingly so our flower is completed Now we are going to make leaf. Start with a slip knot. Chain 7. Skip the first chain. Make a slip stitch in the next chain. One single crochet in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. Make a slip stitch in the last chain. We are going to make one more leaf, chain 7 again. Skip the first chain, make a slip stitch in the next chain. One single crochet in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. One double crochet in the next chain. One half double crochet in the next chain. One single crochet in the next chain. Make a slip stitch in the previous leaf where we did our slip stitch. Fasten off the thread and weave the ends. So we are done with our leaf. Now we are going to take our pin and cover it up with green color thread. Cut off the excess thread. Let it dry for a couple of seconds. Now we are going to make a circle. Start with a magic ring. Chain 3. Make 14 double crochet in the ring. And end it up with a slip stitch in the third chain. So now we are going to assemble all the patterns together. Attach the pattern to the pin. So a beautiful brooch pin is completed. Thank you so much for watching.